Cancer registry is critical for disease surveillance at the national level, and the data captured improves the quality of care for cancer patients. Users must meticulously document patients' age, diagnosis, treatment, and outcome. These data are collected from multiple sources, such as electronic medical records, images, pathology, and lab reports. ASUS Encore is an AI tool that reads through the patient's case notes, extracts out relevant info, and assists the user to fill out the encoding required for the registry system. The upper left-hand side of our AI viewer shows the patient's history. This view consolidates reports from various sources, making it easy for the user to find the relevant information related to this particular patient in a single web app. Filtering tools by specialty, report type, and timeline enable the user to quickly find the information needed to complete the registry entry. Reports are presented in chronological order to ensure quick and easy access for users. Our medication history organizes the medications by types such as chemotherapy, targeted therapy, and radiotherapy. With a standalone presentation of cancer-related drugs, users do not need to look through a long list of medications to find the medications that the patient is taking. Furthermore, the system also consolidates the patient's cancer medication history. It allows users to quickly grasp the cancer patient's treatment process, making it convenient for the users to quickly understand the current treatment plan that the patient is on. Lab reports are presented in a time series, enabling users to look through the report chronologically by using the search tab to filter the test items. The panel on the right is where the user can complete a registry. Our AI system supports the top 10 cancer types in Taiwan, making it easy for users to complete the key information required by the Taiwan National Cancer Registry. Let's take a look at item 4.3.7, which is the targeted therapy starting date. Our AI model suggested that the patient started targeted therapy on September 3, 2020. It determined that the patient started hormone therapy on September 3rd and made recommendations to the user. Once the user has reviewed the content, he or she just needs to check the item. Once the user has checked through the information, he or she can import the content to the hospital system and complete the filing of the case in the Taiwan National Cancer Registry. Once the user confirms that the patient information and content are correct, the submission process is complete. 